let's practice using the right hand rule to figure out whether we have a right handed coordinate system or a left handed coordinate system. And the way this works is that we will always take our right hand and let the fingers point in the plus x direction and then the palm point toward the plus y direction. So I'll show you how that works. In this case, plus x is, well, it's drawn down here, but it's supposed to be pointing out of the page. So I'm going to let my fingers of my right hand point out of the page, and I'm gonna turn my palm to point toward the plus y direction, which in this case is to the right. So my right hand is pointing out of the page and to the right. I will then imagine folding the plus x axis through 90 degrees into the plus y axis, like a little hinge. And as I do that and curl my fingers around, my thumb will point perpendicular to the plane of x and y, and either it will point in the plus z direction, as in this case, so I swing plus x into plus y, thumb points along plus z, that means that this is a right-handed coordinate system. But let's look at another example. So now plus x is pointing up toward the top of the page. So I'll put my fingers in the direction of plus x. Plus y is pointing out of the page. So I'm gonna rotate my hand so the palm points out of the page. Then when I fold plus x into plus y, now my thumb is pointing in the negative z direction. That means that this is in fact a left-handed coordinate system, not right-handed. And one last example. Now again, plus x is pointing out of the page, plus y is pointing up. So my fingers will point out of the page, my palm will point up. I imagine folding plus x into plus y, and my thumb points to the left along plus z. So this is again a right-handed coordinate system.